Live. This is News Channel 8 at 6 on your side. A Bay Area mother sharing her experience after a bounty hunter barged into her home, the wrong home. Good evening, I'm Keith Kate. I'm Jennifer Lee, thank you for joining us. Tonight, that would-be bounty hunter who claimed he was looking for a suspect is a suspect himself. And it was all captured on video, as you saw there, just a portion of it. Eight on your side, Senior Investigator Walt Buteau here now with details. It was a violent case of mistaken identity involving two women with the same name, but different addresses, different cities. Now the man who said he was with a fugitive apprehension team is the one facing charges. About 90 seconds after a man identified as Stanley Wilson knocks on the door, he's accused of kicking it in. Come on, come on that home, come on, come on that home. Come on, you can in the head. I sure did. I sure did. When you see his foot come through that door, what goes through your mind? Um, oh, there's going to be a fighter. There's like, at first I thought, because I heard him yelling after he kicked through the door to come outside, so I thought he had a gun. This is the mugshot of the Jessica Lynn Berry who Wilson said he was looking for on a bond violation. The owner of the company that posted Berry's bail denies Wilson was working for her. This is the Jessica Lynn Berry, a completely different person who actually lives here. What if my kids would have been here and not been at school? What if my kid would have been standing behind the door? And as you can imagine, the video captured by this surveillance camera became excellent evidence for the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office. Where did it hit you after he kicked in the door? Oh, it hit me right now. As soon as he kicked it, uh, the door came back and hit me right, right here. It was a uh, pretty good knot and it was bleeding pretty bad at first. The camera records the sound of a second kick. <laughs> and at one point, we hear the man identified as Wilson egging on Simmons to call the sheriff. Call him now. Call him now. As Wilson leaves, Simmons calls. Hey, this guy's a kid kicked my door and he kicked you. And records we obtained indicate Wilson was arrested four days later and now faces three charges, including an unlicensed bondsman felony. In a brief phone conversation, Wilson denied he went to the home as a bondsman. Barry frustrated that even though she was never heard or seen during the confrontation, the door was still kicked in. I honestly hope it don't happen to nobody else. Like, the whole situation is just screwed up. I talked to a number of local bondsmen, and they said kicking in a door while looking for someone is rare, but they say it does happen from time to time. Well, what might legally allow that for a bondsman to kick a door in? So a couple of bondsmen told us that if they see the suspect inside, they could theoretically kick that door in. It would allow that. They are allowed to use force in an apprehension, but in this case, there are no indications Will Wilson even saw or even heard a female in the home before the door was kicked in. He talked to the man in the home the whole time, never heard the voice of Miss Barry. This just sounds suspicious up it and is. down. It All is. right, thank All you, right. Walt. If you have something you want Walt to investigate, call our 8 on your side helpline at 1-800-338-0808.